The proposed decision by the federal government to ban commercial motorcycle, popularly known as Okada, operations nationwide, is still generating reactions from operators and Lagos residents. At a conference with the All Nigerians Autobike commercial owners and workers, alongside the Civil Liberties Organization, they say an alternative must be provided to avoid worsening insecurity, increased unemployment, and poverty. Inyolu Akopola has more. The planned decision to ban commercial motorcycle operations have been in the mix for years, but this time it might just be definite. Amid the worsening insecurity, the federal government on the 21st of July announced its proposed decision to put a stop to the activities of the two wheelers and mining business nationwide. Since then, there have been mixed feelings with one big question. Would it really tackle this problem or make it worse? The All Nigerians Autobike Commercial Owners and Workers Association, in conjunction with the Civil Liberties Organization, are saying no to this decision, expressing concerns of its negative impacts. A lot of people are involved in this business. It's a business you do, maybe they get 7,000 every day, they do contribution and feed their family. So if they are throwing to the labor market, would, they, would, the, would the rate of crime not increase? Although there are other concerns about unregistered members and the bad eggs in the mist, the president of this association says motorcycle operations have been existing before terrorism. When, you invite, when they invite every stakeholder, we'll come down there and brainstorm on how best we can help government to check crime. While the decision is being made to cut all forms of banditry and stop the supply of funds to terrorists, Okada riders and residents are not positive about the outcome. It's the time of COVID-19, they asked all state government to give people money to feed themselves feed on COVID-19. We do not receive any. Talk about where a band of Okada, then what will happen? Can the state feed people where they stop Okada on the state? Have they, can they provide a, a job to us? Okada will be existing for a very long time. It's not now. It's only now that there's no unemployment that make it to be increased. And some people, the source of their living, According to reports, the motorbike value chain provides jobs for over 30 million people, from the manufacturers, repairers, spare part dealers, down to the consumers. But with this decision to ban motorcycle operations, the certainty of reduction in the space of insecurity is hanging by a thread. But for these operators, they are calling on the federal government to reconsider their decision. In Nyolua, Kukwala, TVC News, Lagos.